the reasons why I first, you know, embarked on this 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 journey uh, are quite numerous. You know, to to begin with, you know, I have to really thank my my mother, who you know basically taught me so much about you know pushing through uh, struggles because she she went through so many struggles and you know we were almost impoverished. And if it weren't for her and the support that she got from a lot of um, networks and charities out there, we would we would have ended up on the street. I just went out and started interviewing people. I, I didn't perceive, you know, um, a, a structured story from <coughs> beginning to end. It was mainly just, and there's no there's no story arc. There's no. It's really just facts and people's opinions and uh, people living in those situations. Sitting in there, talking to people, getting to know what they do, um, what sort of lives they live. You know, it was like really, it was open, mind opening. I was learning all these things. But then there was a point inside the cafe, looking out in the streets of people walking by. You could just see people judging. And that just kind of blew my mind. I just could, I could see people walking past, just looking in to, to the establishment and, and just kind of like almost, almost looking down. Maybe that, maybe that was my perspective. And you know what? I was there too at some stage. I was maybe looking, maybe if I had a bad day or whatever, I'd look at somebody and go, oh, you know, why don't they just get a job? And this, this experience has taught me that that's a stupid way of thinking. That's such a, you know, uh, uh, simplistic, simplistic way, yeah. Like, I mean, based on what you were, you were saying, I mean, there's so many places that, that we need to be made more aware of um, and more scenarios where, um, where I, I mean, I just couldn't cover. want to at least get people thinking, you know, let's talk about these things.